So today as we work on four different drills you can use to stretch out your angles, to create better passing, shooting, driving angles, and manipulate the defense. Watch until the end. This is going to go from beginning, intermediate, all the way to hard. But as I start here, I'm going to go one, two, three, drift. Whatever change of direction moves you like. We're working on these three. Stretching out our dribble, pushing with that turn, pushing the basketball out. Boom, here. Once you've repped that out, now we're going to take out this turn dribble and we're gonna use one of our change of direction moves to get us lateral. Look at it here. One, two, three is when I change. Two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. So as you see, this ball again is spinning in my hand. That's what allows me to cover ground. See that ball spin? So it's not getting stuck. So I don't have to dribble it right away. I'm also not getting my hand underneath to carry. Those are our first two reads off this four part series. Now we're gonna add in attacking downhill and working on that lunge stop with our bounce. So again, it's one, two, three, drift. Boom, we're stopping right here, defender body ball. Ball hits outside my shoe. And we're pulling back. One, two, three, drift. Step in, boom, I'm pulling back. One, two, three, drift, attack. Boom. I'm pulling back right here. One, two, three, drift. Stop. Pull it back. One, two, three, drift. Stop. And then we're pulling back. That's part three of this four part series. Part four, after we go two dribbles, so one, two, third, we're going to float, work on this, being able to stretch out our drive. Boom, we're going to stop and then pull it back. Here we go. One, two, three. Boom, attacking, stopping. Now I'm pulling back. One, two, three, attacking, stopping, pulling back. One, two, three, attacking, stopping, pulling back. One, two, three. Boom, pulling back. Here we go. One, two, three, attacking, stopping, and then pulling back. That's part four of our series. Just trying to be able to stretch our dribbles out, not waste any dribbles. And I know this is a drill. Obviously, you're not going to do all this in a game, but in a game, if I can start to stretch out these dribbles and transition, start to make reads on my defender, I'm whether to go, whether to cut back, pull, or even become a better passer. Let's say you're in the post and I got a six, seven guy with long arms guarding me. I can simply use that float to be able to make that post entry pass down to your teammate. Ball handling just isn't about you. It's about using the space, angles on the court to make your entire team better. Get after it.